welcome to Empowerment Technology. We are now in our lesson number two, which is entitled Software Application and Platforms. At the end of the discussion, we should be able to first identify the different social application and online platforms. Second, compare and contrast the nuances of varied online platforms, sites, and content. Different types of online platforms. Web search engines is a software system designed to search for information on the World Wide Web. The search results are generally presented in a line of results referred to as search engine results pages. First, the communication services. These are outsourced enterprise communication solutions that can be leased from a single vendor or provider. A communication service provider is a provider that transports information electronically and can encompass public and private companies in telecom, internet, cable, satellite, and managed services. Example of communication services is the Smart, the Globe, the Sun Cellular, PLDT, Sky, Dito, yung bago nating um, communication services, the Dito, di ba? So, yun po ang ating mga communication services. Next is the advertising platforms. It allows users to create and manage ad advertising campaigns, generate reports, and retrieve information about the ads, campaigns, and organization associated with an account. Example ko dito is yung AdSense na kinoconnect sa YouTube channel ng mga vlogger. Iyan po yung example ng advertising platforms. Isa pa sa example ng advertising platforms is a Facebook. Diba, um, it's, uh, there's a lot of ads sa mga uh, videos na napikita at napapanood natin sa, um, sa ating Facebook and also YouTube. Diba po, may mga um, advertisement po na napapanood natin sa YouTube. Yun po yung, um, yun po yung mga ads na um, kinonek nila doon sa AdSense na application. Third is a payment system. It is, an, it is any system used to settle financial transaction through the transfer of monetary value and includes the institutions, instruments, people, rules, procedures, standards, and technologies. With the advent of technology, these types of payments are now being done through online transaction. It has made payments and sending or receiving money more comfortable, convenient, less hassle, and not time-consuming for people. Payment transactions are useful in many ways. These are cash, the bills and change. It is one of the most useful ways to use for any purchase. Second, personal checks. It is ordered through one's account. Then third, the debit card. When using this, the buyer takes the money directly out of his account. Let us explore more of social application and platforms. First, the social media. Social media are forms of electronic communication as website for social networking and microblogging, through which users create online communities to share information, ideas, personal message, and other content as videos. Next, the social networking. It is a platform for communicating with one another. Let us now differentiate social media and social networking. What is the difference between social media and social networking? These are forms of media. Essentially, social media is a platform for broadcasting information Whereas social networking is a platform for communicating with one another. Social media is a communication channel, whereas in social networking, communication has a two-way nature. Even with the distinction being given, some nuances can be pointed out. 
as an example of how they differ and yet somewhat overlap. Facebook is a social networking site. You register and post your profile, connect with your friends, and com comment on the topics in a generally interactive way. On that some social networking sites, companies set up a presence and use Facebook as a way to promote their brand and gain followers. Further discussion about the different social applications and platforms. We have platform for advertising. Facebook is an example of a platform for advertising. It's, uh, Facebook advertising is picking up speed in the business world. It uses social graph and activities to pinpoint those who fall into your buyer demographics, making Facebook ads incredibly useful. Facebook ads are more likely to bring in strong leads that are looking for your services. They help make sure your advertising budget is not wasted on those who are not interested in what you are offering. Facebook makes your product or some service put into the hands of the exact person who wants it. Next, platform for hashtagging. Twitter is a fast-paced, concise, and easy way to connect with your audience. With over 3 110 million registered users and growing. Twitter is a sea of information of 140 characters or less content waving to be read, click, followed, and retweet. When marketing on Twitter, you need to have content that is enticing to stop and click through. People are usually scrolling quickly to take more that, just a simple text to stop with them in their tracks. Make sure when you are constructing your tweets, you are making people want to click through. Platform for grouping. LinkedIn. LinkedIn is different from the rest of the social media outlets because it is especially designed for businesses and professionals. Users mainly go to LinkedIn to showcase their job experience and professional thoughts making it one of the most important platforms to use for those in B2B. LinkedIn is a valuable tool not only for driving traffic but prospecting, establishing true leadership, as well as recruiting. Next, platform for teaching. YouTube is the leading video sharing platform in the world. On your channel, your brand can share and edit videos, create playlists, and prompt discussions. So, marami tayong mga nakikita na um, YouTube channel ng mga teachers na kung saan nagkikreate sila ng mga video lesson, ina-upload doon para makatulong sa mga bata na um, yung, di ba, hindi man lahat may kakaya ng makapag-online. So, they use their channel to, uh, to be a teaching, uh, a teaching platform. Di ba? Then also the DepEd TV, may YouTube channel din po ang DepEd TV, di ba? May YouTube channel din ang DepEd, ang ating EdTech unit kung saan nagbibigay din sila ng mga uh, video lessons para sa mga kabataan. Lastly, platform for analyzing business. Pinterest is one of the unique marketing platforms on the list. Instead of posting content for your audience to read, on Pinterest, you will post just a clickable picture and a short paragraph. So, yun po yung nakikita natin, di ba? Once we visit Pinterest, ang nakikita natin mga pictures, uh, short sentences, short paragraphs. Kung saan parang ina-analyze niya yung, uh, ina-analyze niya or uh, nagbibigay siya ng analyzation pagdating sa isang business.